Does your PC have Wintonic? You wonder, is Wintonic a virus or genuine software? In this video, you will know how to remove Wintonic and how it enters your PC. Before we start this guide, press the like button and subscribe to our channel in case you forget later. What is Wintonic? Is it a virus? At the front, Wintonic looks like legitimate software that cleans the infections and optimizes your system. However, it is an unwanted application that uses fake system infection warnings and scam pop-ups to promote itself. The application has several functions including scanning your system for malware, improving the system startup, and protecting from web threats. However, all these features can't be trusted. It shows fake system infections and alerts, and then it also claims to clean them, so that you find it helpful and don't remove it from your system. However, if you don't remove it from your system, it can pose several dangers. Pops like Wintonic could hijack the settings of your browser, can redirect you to malicious pages, record your browsing activity, and steal your confidential data such as credit card information, so you should immediately remove Wintonic from your PC. How does Wintonic enter my PC? Wintonic uses fake warning pop-ups to enter your system. The developer of this software contacts shady websites and displays fake virus warnings as advertisements on their site. These advertisements look legitimate to users and they get frightened and follow the instructions on the fake pop-up to clean the virus infection. That's when they install the Wintonic on their system. The developers of Wintonic also use software bundling to spread it. They bundle it with free or pirated software. When you install such software, you also install the Wintonic. How to remove Wintonic? To remove Wintonic from your system, follow the instructions in their order. Uninstall Wintonic. Click on Start. Type Control Panel. Open it. Click on Uninstall a Program. Now locate Wintonic from the list of installed programs. Select it and click on Uninstall. Follow the instructions to remove it. You might not find it in the program list by the name of Wintonic, so uninstall every program that you don't use and that looks suspicious. Reset Browsers. Wintonic could modify your browser settings and install malicious extensions, so you should reset every browser that you use. To reset the settings of Google Chrome, click on the Menu button, then Settings, Advanced, Reset and Cleanup. Then click on Restore Settings to their original defaults. Now confirm your action. To reset the settings of Mozilla Firefox, click on the Menu button, then Help. Then click on Troubleshooting Information. Now click on Refresh Firefox. Now click on Refresh Firefox again to confirm your action. If you are using Microsoft Edge, open the menu, then go to Settings. Click on Reset Settings from the left sidebar. Now click on Restore Settings to their default values. Then confirm your action by clicking on the Reset button. Scan with Anti-Malware Now you should scan your PC with Anti-Malware to make sure there isn't any hidden adware. You can use Malware Fox Anti-Malware. Download it from the link in the description. Then install it. It effectively catches adware, spyware, rootkits, and all kinds of malware. Now click on Scan. It will take a while to finish the scan. Meanwhile, you can continue your work as it won't slow down your PC. Once the scan is finished, click on Next to clean the detected threats. How to prevent infections like Wintonic? Pups like Wintonic trick users into installing themselves, so you should be aware while browsing the internet, especially while agreeing to install any software. Wintonic uses fake virus warnings on shady websites to spread, so it's better just not to visit such sites. Remember, your browser couldn't know if there's a virus on your system, so if you see a virus found warning on your browser, don't trust it. Do not install free or pirated software from unofficial sources. Also, install robust anti-malware and regularly scan your PC. That's it for this video. If it does help you, press the like button and share the video with your friends. We keep uploading videos related to computer security, so subscribe to our channel and press the bell button to make sure you don't miss anything.